So these are two of my solitary beehives. Um, for those that don't know, solitary bees are another species of bee, like a honeybee or a bumblebee. Um, and they're fantastic pollinators. They pollinate flowers way more um, effectively than a honeybee does. You see there's one going into the bigger hole. Um, and what's great about them is they don't sting. So if you want a beehive, but you're worried about getting stung because you have a pet, or little kids, or you just don't want to bother with a bee um, suit. This is a fantastic project. And all these hives, or I like to call them bee condos or bee motels, are is really just a piece of wood with different sized holes drilled in it. Um, drill a couple inches in and make sure they're protected from the rain, either with an overhang or just by hanging them um, under a roof. And you'll see that there's many different species of solitary bee that live in these various holes from little guys which will take up residence over there to the bigger guys which will live in spaces like this. And it can be very, very simple. Here's one I did last year with just a piece of loose wood I had laying around. And you can see that solitary bees of all sizes will take up residence. And when it's a warm day out, it's about 2 p.m. right now, um, you'll see these guys coming and going. Um, let's see if we can see one there. Can you see him go? He'll probably come out in just a second and say hi. There he goes. Um, it's a really cool project to have. It only takes about an hour to make one of these. And uh, it's fun entertainment. And they are just great at pollinating. So let's see if he comes out. going to work in there. See his little butt wiggling back and forth. And eventually they'll cap this off and I think they lay an egg in there um, for the next generation of solitary bees. And here's the garden. Um, they're great pollinators. So if you have flowers or vegetables, um, they will make sure that every blossom is pollinated. And there's a couple more residents checking in for the day at their bee hotel. So try it out, let me know how it goes.